Some big jackpot winners in Illinois are in lotto limbo until the state passes a budget. Lottery officials say the money for the prizes is there, but they don't have the authority to pay off. Dean Reynolds is looking into this. Rhonda Rashi was a big winner in July, reaping a top prize of $50,000 from a $3 scratch-off lottery ticket. But there is just one thing. She has yet to see the money. I feel like my balloon was kind of deflated, if, if you want to put it that way. Um, I don't feel like it's fair. Republican Governor Bruce Rauner and the Democratic-controlled state legislature have failed to agree on a budget. But without a budget, Rashi and other big winners will just have to wait. We cannot pay those bills until we have a budget in place. Illinois State Comptroller Leslie Munger says the budget impasse is also delaying funding for higher education as well as for student grants and potentially for health insurance payments and benefits for the elderly and disabled. They are all going to have to wait in line uh, until we get a budget. Not so fast, says attorney Tom Zimmerman, who has filed a suit in federal court to get his lottery clients more than an IOU. We don't know if there will be a budget, when there will be a budget, and why should the lottery winners have to suffer? At a convenience store in Chicago, where Rhonda Rashi was pictured as a winner, lottery ticket sales were down, but hope was still up. We watched security officer Mitch Thompson plunk down 10 bucks for a ticket. You know that if you win big, the lottery agency right now can't pay out. Right. Well, I just have to wait. I've been waiting all my life, right? Now, Illinois has the money to pay the 29 big winners what they are owed, which the lottery says is about $41 million currently, and prizes of less than $25,000 are being paid. But Scott, Without a budget deal, those big winners are out of luck. Dean Reynolds in the Chicago newsroom tonight. Dean, thanks very much.